everything you need to know about the fall 2020 real estate market. Hi everyone, I'm Tony Verdi, Associate Broker at Caldwell Banker Realty in East Greenwich. The fall real estate market begins now, and I want to give you a brief update on the remarkable activity we're seeing despite the COVID-19 national pandemic. On a national level, the National Association of Realtors predicted this year's home sales would end up higher than the 5.34 million homes sold in 2019. NAR Chief Economist Lawrence Yun even predicts home sales will rise 8 to 12% in 2021. Now, what's causing home sales and prices to skyrocket in the midst of a national pandemic and high unemployment? First, the awesome power of low mortgage rates, under 3%. Second, low housing inventory. And third, increased buyer demand for reasons resulting from COVID-19, such as changing lifestyles with many people now required to work and learn from home in need of more space and multifunctional homes. Plus, homeowners in cities are flocking to the suburbs or further out in more affordable smaller towns. Here in Rhode Island, the outlook is similar. Housing inventory is too low to meet buyer demand and we're not seeing an end in sight. Homes are selling in record time in all price categories, in most cases within 24 hours. Multiple offer situations are the norm and homes are selling for above asking price. It's important to be cautious, however, because you don't want to find yourself in a situation a year or two from now, realizing you paid far too much. I'll help make sure you don't cross that line. August was the 43rd consecutive month in which the median price of monthly sales rose from the previous year. The median price of a single family home now is just over $333,000. Home sales here in Rhode Island are up 7% year over year, worsening the already shortage of homes on the market. And homes listed for sale dropped over 42% compared to fall 2019. Now, experts predict this market frenzy, frenzy will level off when a COVID-19 vaccine is available and stimulus money runs out. But until then, instead of experiencing the usual fall and winter decline in home sales and prices here in Rhode Island, we will at least hold the current record high level going into the fourth quarter of 2020. Now, the bottom line is don't be afraid if you need to buy or sell a home in these changing times. I'm here to guide you with the latest market data and tools. And if you're thinking of selling and want to cash in on your increased equity, I can give you a professional equity assessment report. This will determine your home's cash value and can be an invaluable tool. I hope you found this market update helpful. If you have any questions, please call me at 401-225-7800 and visit my website, thesignatureoftrust.com. I'm Tony Verdi, Associate Broker at Caldwell Banker Realty. Thanks for watching.